Hello YouTubers and fellow Whovians, and once again welcome to another Doctor Who action figure review. As you can see today I shall be taking a look at the Clara Oswald figure which comes as part of the new 5.5 Collector Series range of figures. So first things first, we're going to take a look at the packaging of this figure. Now as of all the 5.5 Collector Series figures, it comes in a window box packaging. It says the character's name, so in this case it's Clara Oswald, posable action figure, 5.5 Collector's range. We have the old Doctor Who Classic Series logo, which is kind of interesting seeing as Clara Oswald is from the new series instead of the Classic Series. It seems like they're using this logo on pretty much all of the merchandises now. On the back we've just got a bio of the character and we've also got a promotional image of the figure as well as a quote from the character. Into the articulation of the figure, the head can move a little bit, it's hindered by the hair. The arms can do a 360 degree turn and the elbows can move from out to the side because they are ball jointed. The biceps can also do a 360 degree turn, but be wary, they can snap off, so I wouldn't play with that too much. The elbows can also move up and down, there is no articulation at the wrists. There is articulation in the waist underneath the dress, there's also articulation in the knees, and also the trainers can do a 360 degree turn. So now with the articulation out of the way, what do I think of this figure? I think this figure has an excellent likeness to Jenna Coleman. We just get a close up of the face here. I think it really looks spot on. It looks much better in hand than it does online with all the images of the figure. I think it absolutely looks brilliant, spot on likeness looks very much like Jenna Coleman, much, much better than the 3.75 counterpart. The hair has also been nicely detailed, and it's been uh, given a black and brown wash, which is kind of what Jenna Coleman's hair looks like. So that's nice density of detail. The dress has also got some nice detail. It's painted in this sort of purple colour. We've got these creases here and there on the, you might be able to see it on camera. Um, the dress is made out of this sort of PVC material so it feels very plastic. Um, the leggings, the tights, they've been just painted black and they're basically uh, painted over the skin because for some of you eagle eye viewers, this is actually a repaint of the Oswin Oswald action figure. Now, I don't have the Oswin Oswald action figure as I am filming this review. If I did, I would have done a comparison, and that probably would have been much easier to do. don't know why I don't have that figure, to be honest. But the boots, or the trainers, they've just been painted over as well. It's painted all black, basically. Um, the arms... Just part of the dress goes to the arms, to the elbows, and then on her left arm she has a bracelet on the wrist. So for the most part I think the detail and the articulation all around is very good. It makes for a very nice figure. Um, the episode this is based on is... Um, I don't recall an episode this version of Clara appeared in. Um, oh, it's because she never ever wore this in the series. Yes, this is basically just a repaint. Clara never ever wore an outfit like this. So technically, this is just artistic license. Uh, by that, what I mean is Clara never ever wore anything like this. She never appears, so this doesn't really represent Clara as she appeared in series 7, 8 or 9 for that matter. Um, which is a shame, but I think if you want a Clara Oswald action figure 
this is the closest that you're ever going to get, to be honest, because I doubt that they're ever going to make another one of these, and if they did, then they might want to retool it. I was hoping for them maybe releasing a version of Clara based on her appearance in The Time of the Doctor or Deep Breath, because I really like that costume, but for now... It looks like we've just got this version of Clara, or if you want another version, then you can get the Oswin figure, which is basically the same figure as this, but it's slightly different with the belt and the red dress and all of that. Here she is compared to both Doctors that she travelled with, and here she is compared alongside all the new series companions, Rules Tyler, Donna Noble, Martha Jones and Amy Pond. She stands just about the same size as all of the other figures and maybe she's a little bit taller, just a tiny weensy, weensy little bit. But um, I think having all these together now, I think that this new Clara figure is actually the best of the bunch, it has the best likeness. Because I said in past reviews when I've reviewed these ones that the detailing of the face character options kind of struggled with the female figures but I think with this figure they've done a really good job and that concludes my review of this action figure so overall would I get this figure personally I highly recommend that you pick up this figure it's available in Toys R Us stores now and thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this review and found it very informative. Please leave a like, comment and subscribe to my channel. And if you haven't already, you can like my new Facebook page as well as join my Facebook group. You can find the links to those in the description of this video. See you next time.